Greetings and welcome back to Infraspace. I'm Catherine of Sky and a huge thank you to everyone who subscribes to the channel because you are in for a a while of craziness here at the very least. <laughs> so anyway, we discovered last time a very big problem with our lovely roundabout that was working perfectly until we kind of had more demand on everything. So we need to fix that. Um, one thing that also might help us is having these things not having an entrance and exit that is the same. So I'm going to go ahead and pause the game and we're going to delete some stuff, including these things here. It was beautiful while it was, yeah, while it lasted, but it is time for this to end. So what we want to start off with here, I think, is let's go with getting this highway organized. And we are going to do a uh, kind of a clover leaf. I don't know if we're going to do the entire clover leaf, but we'll do some of it at least. So let's start out with this part here. We're going to go up. There we go. We can go just one up and then take that one down. Okay. So that's good. So what lanes do we actually need to happen? So copper does need to enter onto this highway. So let's take a lane. I don't think we need more than one lane. I think that we can have just one. So let's start out with this. Like that. Okay. And do we need some of this material in here? I don't think so. I think the iron is coming from over there, so that's not needed. Now, um, stuff that is coming out. This is the hard part. How do we rearrange this? I do not want to repaste all of these buildings and stuff. I feel like we should just have one ways going into this section. Um, and then we can have one road coming out. I feel like that's probably the best way of doing things. Um, let's see, do we need, this can actually be a one way coming out here. I think that's probably the way to do this. Let's have this one way going this way. And then we'll have a one way coming out of this as well. I want to delete this road because this is not doing what I want it to do right now. So let's just make all of these one ways. Uh, are we able to actually function this way? How much um, do these need? These are 36 seconds for two. And this makes two and 32 seconds. Okay, so if I move these up a bit, it should work. So if I move these here, this should work because it'll be ahead of that one factory. I think this is probably going to work. If it doesn't, we can try to rejig it. It should be fine. Uh, but I don't really want to redo the entire thing right now. Okay, so let's do one way roads. All of this stuff going the correct way. All right, cool. This is working well. All right, so all of this can come out. And then we're going to take it this away. So let's go this and down. All right. And then go this away. Okay. Yep. It's perfect. Now then we're going to come out this way and there's going to be a far more stuff coming out than going in. Oh, and I used highways. No. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're gonna, <laughs> that, I was like, why are there all those road signs? Yep. It's because we used highways and you cannot connect to a highway from a building because it's got like little walls on the side. Like you would expect a highway to have. Um, you know, like you cannot stop immediately and turn uh, to either side because it is a highway. So, right. What we want to do here then is probably kind of do some kind of a fly over here to get on that side of the road. Now, none of this needs to go to the right, so we don't have to worry about that. 
But I'm wondering if maybe, let's see, we can maybe do a sneaky thing into here. But also this can be a highway, right? Starting here, we definitely can make this highway instead. So replace this with highway because there's nothing, nobody's coming off of here. This can be the high speed zone. Okay. And take this over. We need to go up. Okay. Like that. I'll keep it up and then we'll take this down. Okay. Yep. There we go. All right. I think that should work a lot better. So let's see how that works. So we do have the ability for copper to go up here, which is needed. We have the copper coming in here, which is also needed. Oh, we forgot to reconnect the power. So let's fix that. This is actually far simpler than I thought we would need. But, oh, wait, why is copper going this way? Do we need copper here? Oh, we do. Oh, I didn't realize that. Okay, that's uh, that's something interesting. So let's make that a possibility as well, because I don't want this intersection to do that at all. That's a bit strange. Okay, that's fine. We also need to fix this intersection. You can go there. Um, hmm. Yeah, we don't want to do that. Okay. Uh, there we go. Actually, this one can go there, probably. Um, yes. Good. Uh, this one will turn around. Take this one off. Uh, yep. Nine, 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 nine. Down there. Down there somewhere, please. Aha! This is bad. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, let's delete that and something here, I guess. Okay, let's fix this again. Okay, gotta remember to put that in a different way. I think we have some issues because of the height here. So I want to increase this height possibly. Let's move this and go up a tiny bit. There we go. Yes, okay, that will make things a little bit easier, I think, with adding this little thing in here. Let's go down on the ground and have this one connect a little bit, maybe here, like that. Okay, that seems better. Okay, uh, except for this part, which is not ideal. Dang it, I always try to make these things work and they just wanna do their own thing sometimes. Okay, let's add that there. Okay, good, good, good. All right, so let's add this thing. This is performing very strangely. This can go there, that can go straight. All right, things are working, maybe. Let's see how they work. The copper should start coming down this side pass because it's not allowed to go that way anymore. So this should be better. But we also are lacking this iron coming in and that iron needs to come in right here. So let's take that. We need to make this probably a highway during some of it, at least. Let's take this here and there and basically just kind of uh, get this up from here and raise it up a tiny bit, maybe two. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that way we're getting a little bit of iron as well through here, so that's good. Okay, electronics going, not electronics, uh, home appliances going that away. Ooh, where are these uh, green chips going? I'm curious about this. I'm gonna follow this green chip car. because I wonder where that one is sneaking off to. Up this way? Okay. I'm curious. I'm intrigued. What needs green chips up here? Is it science? Oh, it is. 
I forgot. Did one, oh, yeah. These green science packs need science. I forgot about that. You know what? I completely forgot about that. That greens uh, are needed there. But in any case, this looks a lot better. It is flowing very smoothly. Looks like we don't have any issues right now. This is pretty darn good. Okay. Wow. Good. Very good. And we're getting a little bit more of our steel in. Yeah, the science right now is painfully slow. We only have three, um, three yellow science at the current moment. So I really do want to improve this situation here. Yeah, all of this is like... I'm surprised they don't have more nanotubes. Are they going around some way and like refilling these guys or something? Huh, I wonder. Interesting. Anyway, uh, let's see. We want to build that last factory for here because we didn't quite finish that one section. We're just going to go right there. Now let's see if we can build another set. Okay, there we put that one, get this one, okay, and then our two factories for nanotubes and neural processors. Just make sure the roads are correct here, they all flow correctly. We can probably do one more as well, maybe. Don't know if we can fit it with these roads the way they are. We can try. Let's see, put nanotubes over here. And neural processors here. Oops. I guess it can be over there. That's not oh geez, more steel needed. Still not enough steel. Darn it. Let's see, how are these steel plants going? They are, let's see, they do seem to have enough materials. So I think we can just build more steel plants. Let's see, let's get rid of this road. Cause this is what our remnants from the previous build. And I think we'll just build another road. And one that will help us make some more materials. So that's really what we're lacking here. Let's see. Let's see. Mm -mm -mm. There we go. There's our steel mill. And we'll just put them on this side. Uh, oh, what we could do is actually move them around and have them slightly different. Well, darn it, I wanted it to connect over here, but it's fine. It doesn't really matter. Move this away. Perfect. We can maybe move this building a tiny bit. Does that help us? Maybe. Yes, good, good. All right, four more steel plants. We'll see how that works. Uh, we might need another iron... Uh, iron mine. There's a large iron mine here. Do we have enough people, by the way? Yeah, we do. We still have enough people, so that's good. I haven't really thought about population in such a long time because it feels like you really don't need uh, that much. Really don't need that much. Or that much thought into it. Though we're getting close. We have uh, 1,600 jobs and 1,800 people. So there's a few people that don't have jobs, but they're just like living a life of leisure. Don't worry about them too much. They're fine. Okay, let's look at the other things that we need here. We are lacking a tiny bit of food, but I think we know about this. Uh, the most important part is the good meals, which we are fulfilling in spades. Let's see. This one has gone up a tiny bit, but not nearly enough. Motors, we also need more of, but I think that's a science issue mostly. So it doesn't really affect our people. So that's good. Let's see. We have... Yeah, we're lacking most of these uh, nano thingies. Neural sensors. And that is not, not great. Definitely not great. 
So let's see, how can we improve this, this whole thing? Should we just add more? I guess we can add more neural sensor array things uh, and nanotube factories, all of that kind of stuff. Let's see, the biggest building I think is the green circuit factory. So I'm going to be just placing one somewhere like here so that we can kind of have a road here that will give us what we want. Okay, so these are this kind of road, but we need this point moved somewhere. Moved close by. Let's see, so let's move this one like there. I think that will work. Get this one moved there. Ah, that's perfect. That is perfect. Except for this bit, which isn't perfect. Alp. Let's see, can we move it up? Nope, that's too far. That is also too far, I think. Yeah, 16, 15. I feel like the world is curved or something. It never is quite right. It's so weird this way. It's like, what? Oh, that's right. The reason I... Okay, I remember. I did it from the other side last time. That's right. I did it from this side. Yeah, that was the thing that I did last time. All right, let's reverse this road. So it is correct. Okay, very good. And now we connect this up because that's needed. Ay, nay, 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 nay. Oof, overshot that. Let's do that again. Okay, there we go. Okay, so, um, yeah, I guess we just keep on following our plan here of having these two sand mines here and getting this going. Okay, large sand mine, have that kind of there. And then I guess I can put them two in a row, maybe. It doesn't really matter. I guess we can skip the first area. Uh, okay, so we have this, we need just the regular stuff. Glad that all of these buildings are in the same category. That makes it a bit easier to work on. There's this, and then we need our nanotubes and then the neural processor factory nice okay and then this again then this actually this one doesn't have to be there this has to be after the other one oops wait did it nope didn't click okay ah because no steel Ugh. this lack of steel dang it help Oh, we're actually lacking carbon now. We have new problems. Hooray. <laughs> this is good. New problems are always good. So let's see. Do we have enough oxygen? Probably. Do we have oxygen? We do have enough oxygen, but we can always use some more. So I think what I'll do is, let's see. This road is connected this away. So if we put some oxygen makers here, which we can then replace with carbon makers... Things will be better. Let's see. Let's get our... Where are they? They're in here. There they are. So here we go. This one is 8 seconds for one oxygen. And 8 seconds for one carbon. That is so easy. I can't wait to get those. Wow. Then we can actually have stuff where we want it instead of where, um, where we have to kind of put stuff. Yeah, that would be very, very nice. Okay, let's just delete that road. It's not needed. Well, actually it is needed, isn't it? Um, okay, let's choose a different way to add stuff. No, 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 I missed it again. I keep missing these things. Okay, so this is there. Let's put a road that way. Go to two land. Is that too far? I think it's a bit too far. I'll delete this a bit. Um, maybe delete that. Move this one up a bit. Like there. Aha, that's better. And then we can just kind of connect maybe this way. It's okay if it's not completely parallel. I'm not really worried about that at all. So we'll just move this one down and snapping is fine. 
There we go. Okay, so we have more stuff now. We have made more things. More carbon to feed our steel factories because that's the most important thing. We don't mind about this whole breathing thing. I don't know what people are on about. It's not that exciting anyway. Yes. <laughs> okay, so this is working really well. I'm liking this new setup here. This reduces so much traffic. Oops, God, go away. Uh, this, um, you know, having a one-way roads really reduces a lot of the cross traffic and kind of craziness that we have had before. So this is extremely good. I'm, I'm very happy about this. This is working well. Look at this traffic. It is merging the way it's supposed to. Um, yeah, because a lot of all of this traffic is going into the left lane, leaving these guys open to come in here because this is actually a huge, huge entrance with a lot of production coming off of here. So that's really cool. That is really good. Really, really good. Okay, so this is sand mine. All right. Looks like this is lacking sand and I don't know why. I wonder if we should build another one. Let's go ahead and do that. I wonder if some of the sand is going into the wrong areas. Let's see. As in these sand mines are feeding or these ones are feeding these computer thingies or these other thingies. I don't know. I don't know how that's working. But anyway, it's okay. We're um, we're trying to work it. So let's see. We are out of power. So that's something we need to address uh, immediately, if not sooner. So let's add a few more power devices. Let's see, can we add more wind turbines? Wow, we can. There we go. So that's weird that sometimes the AOE doesn't show up. It's a bit odd. Okay, let's just put this one as close as we can there. And then let's put in a solar panel. And then another wind mine. Uh, oh, okay. That one's going to have to go like around here. That's That works though. Let's put it decoratively. Sure. And then here we'll just put in... Oh, we don't have enough steel. No! Oh, we're limited by steel. This darn thing. This is, this is actually really frustrating that there's not enough uh, carbon here for us. But, wait a second here. It looks like some of this carbon has to go all the way around to get to those things. These guys kind of moving stuff around. I guess what I could do is if I want to be mean, <laughs> I could deprive these people of, well, I guess, I don't know. Maybe we don't have to have oxygen up here. I guess it doesn't matter one way or the other because these are the only places that really use carbon is this and the uh, the other parts here. I, well, these do. These actually use carbon as well. Quite a lot of it as well. So maybe adding all of this extra stuff was maybe not great. However, we could add more carbon making machines here. The, the breathing devices. So let's see, this is 16 seconds to produce one carbon and they need uh, five carbon in 60 seconds. Let's see. Let's try to do some math on the calculator. 60 divided by 16. I have no idea if that's close. It's 3.75. Um, 3.75 times, well, that's how much. They make 3.75 uh, oxygen in 60 seconds so you need more than one oxygen or carbon maker whatever these things are atmosphere processors per each one of those things so no wonder we're running out um i think what we're gonna do is we might actually add some of these lovely lovely little things in this area because i think we need them definitely need them um so if I want to be smart about stuff, what I can do is I can take off these roads. Maybe, maybe what we do is we add this last highway. Uh, actually we can do like this. 
but then convert them to these. At least for these areas. And kind of have them on the sidelines here. And make oxygen makers here. So just to help this crisis of steel and, and, and carbon and stuff. <laughs> I feel like it's definitely a crisis that needs solving immediately, if not sooner. Yeah, I think this is this is what we need. Some of this ox or some of the carbon can also go down this road as well, if it's not enough having these. But that's gonna definitely help the situation, I think. I think we I grossly underestimated the amount of carbon we needed for those buildings. So I think what I wanna do is I want to huh. Maybe I maybe I need to make a district here and just make these guys for here. Let's see. Production overview. Oh, no, no, no. Go back. Okay, so... This districts. Here it is. Let's see. Carbon. I'm going to make a carbon district. It's going to be this. Huh. This here. Uh, and should I... Can I include some of this? I don't know if I can or not. Can I do a tiny bit? Tiny add-on? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Uh, and then we'll add, make the steel district. There we go. Here's steel. So we're going to add all of this stuff into steel district land, including these things as well. No, 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 bad. Oh my God. Come on thing. Why are you doing this to me? Look, I want to make steel. Okay, fine. We'll do it that way. This is so confusing, this 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 part of the UI. I have to say, it's like, you click one thing, then that thing goes off. It's like, I want to make steel, but I also want this thing. And then to click from district to district, it's like, what? Okay, carbon. Let's try this. Click there and there to go there. Okay. So all of this should be going there. I don't know if we're going to get any oxygen out of it, so we're not going to hold our breath, literally. Um, let's see. Construction material shortage. All right, but I think we're, in general we're doing really well. This this area has been improved markedly, as you can see. Let's check up here and just make sure everything's flowing well, and it is. It's beautiful. Hooray. Okay. Do we need anything like food, water, anything? No, we're good. We're good. Okay, cool. Looking good. We have some power. Not enough. Let's get more power. I feel like I need to make vast swathes of power. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to make some here, I think. And I'm just going to be quite, I don't know, militant about it, I guess. So I'm going to try to do a, oh, I don't know if that works very well. Trying to like make it square. Okay, this is good. Square to the axis of moving the camera. That's almost correct. Oh no, I don't have enough. No. Come on, steel. Hurry up. Go, go, go. Give us more steel. We want, we need. In steel we trust. Let's go. Give us, we have 92. I hate to lose the rotation on this, but it's just going to have to happen. I would love to see a um, pipette tool with rotation uh, as well. Like you grab something and it will give you the exact rotation of what you need. I would, I really want that. I'm hoping for that. It would be lovely if we had that. I wonder if this counts if we like just have it inside the zone. Yes, apparently it does. That's nice. Uh, maybe. Wait, is this a different district? It is Power Network 2. No. It has to be connected, apparently. I guess it makes sense in a way, but it also feels very redundant. Okay, there we go. We are... Wait. Eh? Oh no, I thought we... I thought this was a transform, and I'm like, no, wait a second, hold on, just hold up one second there. <laughs> okay, so we have now power. That's good. 
But yeah, wow, we're still lacking carbon. Help. Wow. So much carbon and lacking. Oh, yeah, yeah. But I guess, man, I really want this technology. Help. Okay, you know what? We're just going to have to kind of get, get with the program here. What do you do when you don't have enough stuff? You don't wait for it. You don't AFK. You build it. That's what you do. And that's important. Building is important. Uh, okay, can we move that slightly? There we go. Okay. I'm just going to build some, like, temporary stuff here. I am actually planning on making this temporary, by the way. It's not just a joke. I want to replace these with carbon processors. Uh, yeah. Because I feel like it's definitely not... Not interesting... At the moment. To have these, like, millions of... of both processors and not having a convenient way to ship store them. Or ship slash store them, I suppose. I should speak in slashes instead. Alright. More is here. No! No! Why? Oh. Uh, well, that helps, I guess. Uh, let's get the proper road here. Does that make it better? I don't know if this is actually 90 degrees or not. Let's see. Where is our thingy majingy again? There we go. Yep, it works. It works now. So this is many. Okay, we happy? We're working? Doing good? Steel mill. I kind of feel like moving one of these. Move it here instead. Whoopsies. There we go. Like this. That way that can speed it up. Not that that helps with the, the oxygen production. Oh wow, there are so many, so many trucks walking or uh, running this way. Lots of trucks doing their thing. I wonder what they're delivering. Because it's like they go in, but they don't actually increase the number. Or are they... I wonder if they are... Because every one of them is going in there and they're all carbon. I feel like is stuff getting wasted? I'm unsure what's going on here because there's no way that it's using that many carbon per second at all. There is no way that they need this. This feels like a bug. Like, this is nuts. Why are they all coming in here if it's already full? I don't get that at all. Unless they come into one and it refills all of them. That was really strange. Unless it ha something happened because I moved it, maybe? That may be a thing. I don't know. That's really odd. Let's go here. So let's see if the same thing happens with this one. Oh, no, 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 no. Gosh, no, stop. Okay. I meant to click on it, but I had the uh, thing still activated there. That was not ideal. All right. So that's another thing that happened. Okay. Okay. Things are going swimmingly, maybe. All right. This is still working, which is great. I do want to finish this build. Let's go ahead and make make something happen with that. So let's see. We want to do nanotubes here. And then we want to do electronic bits and pieces here. And then neural processors out here. Glorious. Okay, good. That's another something to do though. That's good though. This is working. Really working. Good, good. I feel like having a factory out here is good as well. I think that should be enough space for this. Let's see. Let's just check. Let's 
Yeah, oh, wow, that is perfect. <laughs> I eyeballed it so well there. That's just beautiful. Dang. Oh, that's nice. All right, let's move this wind mine. Okay, there is good. Okay, cool. All right, so, wow, this one is now at 164% efficiency. Perfect. Looking good. And we have many more carbon mines, so that is excellent. Let's see, these, um... I wonder if I should, let's see, these guys I think are feeding these, but I do wonder if we're allowed, if these things are allowed to escape or not, as in, can that carbon escape outside? This I do not know. Hmm. It's very good question to ask, I think. I think I will ask about that because that is a very big curiosity for me. Uh, I feel like the rules are quite simple, as in, I would love to have like a sort of a checkbox system of having these districts, for example, and clicking on one of them, or yeah, something, the district itself would bring up a checkbox of, you know, is such and such material allowed to leave the district? That would be really great, because I do try to mix the districts and stuff. Um, like I don't want circuits to go over here because this is already matched the way I want it to be. Oh, there's a problem down there as well. But it would be nice to have like a checkbox thing. Kind of like, um, well, I'm not going to say, I'm not going to say Timberborn because that is not the ideal for sure. <laughs> but it would be nice to have a checkbox thingy where, you know, you say, say have all the products on there. And you have uh, something like allowed to leave checkbox vertical column, checkbox for every item, or allowed to enter or some maybe not well allowed to enter. Yeah, maybe not allowed to, allowed to enter as well. As in like you can't allow uh, extra green chips to come into this district, for example. Uh, you only want to use the green chips within here, so none is allowed to enter for. Yeah, I think that would work really nicely uh, because that would prevent a lot of like the weird stuff, like the cross map uh, distribution of stuff. And I think that would work better. So this, I think I want to just delete this district altogether. All of these, I don't want them. Yeah. Oh, no, no, go away, go away, go away. But um, yeah, something like that might work a bit better. This is feels very rudimentary and it's very kind of weird. I'm glad it exists, but I don't feel like it functions up to what I would like to see completely. Yeah. All right. So that's that. Uh, but anyway, we have some steel, which is good. And I want to make more nanotubes and stuff because that's what we're really lacking. So this thing is requiring what? It needs more of these and this needs more carbon. So let's see. Let's go ahead and make the next thing. I think we're just lacking the carbon because we're lacking carbon. But we can extend these roads actually and... See, I can extend them this away, for example. Uh, this one could be moved. Yeah, we can move this one this away. Okay. And then get this one extended. I guess I can make them one-way roads as well. I don't know if it's really necessary, but it, yeah, it's fine, I guess. Okay, there and there and reverse the thing. Okay, good, good. And let's get our thing. Go here and there and there and one more. Okay. All right. No, what are we lacking? Help colliding? What is it colliding with? Couldn't be colliding with anything. There's nothing there. Not even a mountain. No, no. <laughs> Let's see if I can move this one down a bit. Actually, I can move that one there and have this one there. That way that one can come down and get a tiny bit more space for that one. That's perfect. Okay. And power. We need a substation, I think. I'll just put a tiny substation maybe there. 
That will work. Okay, fantastic. Looking very good. We still have, we have now tons of steel actually. So I want to build some more. Let's grab some of this fun, fun stuff. Just build again and let's see, neuroprocessors. Oh, not that. We want nanotubes. Nanotubes, then we get this thingy. And then our beautiful neural processors. They go there. Okay. Oh, I forgot to put another sand mine. Oh boy. You know what? I think I may need to move this section down a bit. I forgot how many we needed there. How many a sand mine could support. So that's two groups. And I think that's it's time for another sand mine. Definitely. Okay, let's move this. Okay, and this can go. Urgh. I don't know where that can go. I guess this one will go here. Or even better, I switch the green with this thing. There we go. Green goes there. This thingy goes there. Okay, and then we have this guy. Come on right there. Okay, perfect. Okay, and then do this again. Yeah, I would really love to have the uh... Oh, I completely forgot what it's called now. No, pipette tool. That's what I mean. Yes. Pipettes. Hooray. Okay, so now we got we got stuff going on here. Okay, we got sand, we got vehicles, we got stuff and things. Okay, cool. It's mostly. Let's see, how's this going? I love these rivers of traffic. It looks so beautiful, doesn't it? Isn't it great? I think I'm gonna have to make like a, an end screen with all of this like traffic. It's so cool to watch. Ah, oh, so great. I love to have these like complicated highway systems and stuff. And it this is such a strange game because most of the time you only need to go one direction so you don't have to have like full cloverleaf junctions you just have to have a way from that for them to get to where you want them to go so it's kind of funny that way see these are are these actually functioning oh oh what's going on oh there we go okay so those are functioning somewhat and we are actually making progress on this it is extremely slow progress and I'm so glad that we chose this particle filter first. This is massively necessary <laughs> because those new machines are going to cut this time down by half. So that is super, super important, I think. I also think we might... Well, I guess if we put the carbon makers near the nanotubes, it's just going to make the nanotube factory more efficient but it's not going to uh, speed up the base makers. So that is something we need to consider for sure. I guess we can go ahead and get another road here and kind of continue this tradition that we have started of making stuff here. Oh, whoops. I didn't do the correct one. Go here and there. All right, and there. All right, I think this is where we're going to leave off for today. Uh, we have made much progress, done many things, and I think in the last ones was when we created more of these, <laughs> more of these signs, signs of the times. Yes, uh, I'm going to check on these buildings. Okay, it looks like we're just missing home robots, and maybe that's what we need to do next: is just kind of build stuff up a tiny bit and maybe get some stuff going. But yeah, they need more of those stupid neural network thingies no help ay yeah yeah so those are let's see these are neural processors yeah they need this entire combination of things i'm thinking though for the home robot factory we might make that in some in another place uh maybe we'll go and get copper and iron from here or or somewhere else see we have iron there we have copper here 
That might be okay, though this is kind of our... Oh, wait, here's iron and copper. This might be a good area here to make the home robots. And just have them coming in from a different direction as well. Uh, and I want to have them, like, encapsulated with stuff as well. But yeah, this is going to be a big build because we need to have the motors too. Let's see, those were... Yeah, copper and steel. Oh my gosh, we're going to have even more stuff. These home robots sure are sturdy. None of these plastic Roombas and stuff. We're having like serious home robots. Anyway, that is all we have time for today. Thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.